Hey guys, so I have another review for you, and it's another review for Lux Addiction. They sent me another cell phone case, and um, I'm going to show it to you guys, and I'll talk about the packaging and the quality of the cell phone case and all that good stuff, because I've gotten quite a few questions about the quality of the product. So, first of all, um, if you don't know about Lux Addiction, they're a company who makes cell phone cases and here's one of the cases that they make it's on their card and I'll put the links for their sites down below so you guys can check them out and um, all of their cases are 3D Swarovski crystal ones um, they're all covered in Swarovski crystals and I don't even think I'm saying that right but um, they're all customized so if you see a certain style on the website they, if you order it, it's probably going to have like some jewels and stuff switched around, but if you tell them that there's something particular that you like on the phone case, they'll make sure that it's on there for you, which is really cool. That's one of the big reasons why I like them. Um, this is the cell phone case I got. I don't remember what um, style number it is, but I will put it down in the bottom bar for you guys if you're interested. Um, this is a turquoise one, and that's what caught my attention. It's one of the newer ones that they just made. And my favorite color is turquoise, so that's one of the big things that caught my attention with this phone. Um, so when I looked at it, um, there's a couple peace signs on the back, and I really like that too. So I'll just show you the front first. It has some flowers on here. And all along the sides, there's like some pearl type beads and then some more flowers on the top and a heart and um, it's not just all one blue it's as you can see the side is darker and then this side's lighter over here and then on the back um, it has this peace sign and it has some more flowers and I really really like these these kind of look like um, they're made out of a porcelain material um, and then I really like these stones right here too. There's a few of those on here and one right here. Um, I don't know if you guys can notice this, but this whole thing right here is also a peace sign. And when I first looked at this phone, I didn't even notice that that's what it was. But that's my favorite part on this whole entire phone case. So I really like that. And as you can tell, it's really detailed. Um... It's 3D, and the gems do obviously pop out. There's not, like, a cover or anything on it. Um, so, the packaging is really, really good. Um, I've gotten a few phone cases from them already, and this is the box that it comes in. And then when you open it, um, the phone case is actually... It snaps off and on so there's two separate pieces here and um, they're each in their own little um, bag and then those two bags are in this one and it they always come with this white drawstring bag with lace right here and then this is wrapped inside bubble wrap and that is put into the box like that so it doesn't um, slide around or anything it fits perfectly in there so when it's being shipped to your house if the mailman is one of those careless ones and they just throw the stuff everywhere um, it's not gonna get damaged or anything um, you guys saw the card that came with it too and then it also comes with these extra gems just in case any fall off which is good and that leads me to the next thing um, a lot of people ask me if the gems fall off easily and Honestly, they don't fall off that easily. Um, the first phone case that I got from them, I dropped it a couple times on the concrete and um, I was really scared because I didn't want anything to fall off of it. And I was looking really closely and nothing fell off the first few times that I dropped it. Um, after a while though, I kind of got careless with my phone and I do drop my phone a lot. So after so many times of dropping it, a few things might fall off, but it's not even noticeable anyway because there's so much on the phone case. And um, and it's just, it's really, really good quality. Um, I have 
another phone case that I got from them. It's the leopard one. I don't remember what style number that is, but um, I think only two little tiny gems might have fallen off on that one. And like I said, again, um, I throw my phone in my purse and my purse is really, really big. I have a big purse just like a lot of other girls do. And um, it kind of slides around and stuff in there. So um, I feel like this one I'm absolutely in love with. All their phone cases are, are amazing. Um, I love my other ones too, but this one's turquoise and it's just, I don't know. I really, really like this one. But um, they do make a ton of different um, cell phone cases for the iPhone, the Blackberry, and I don't remember the other cell phones that they make them for, but I do know that they have a pretty good sized list of the different types of phones that they make them for. Um, they have different styles, a ton of different colors, so if you're interested in getting one, I'm sure you'll find one on there that you like. Um, they do customize them, so if you want to contact them and ask them to put something specific on there, then they'll do that for you. A lot of people complain about the price. Um, they say that they're too expensive, but in my opinion, these probably take them so long to make individually. Look at all of these jewels on here. And, um, like I said, they're really durable and they don't fall off easily. So I bought, um, a regular cell phone case from Best Buy and I think the brand was in case and it was just a plain white case. Um, it was plastic. Uh, and I do drop my phone a lot, so after a while, like not even that long of having it, the corners would chip off, and um, it just, I spent $40 on it, and that to me is a waste of money, because if it's not going to last that long, then there's no point in buying it, and I didn't really think that it would do that, but it did, so um, I know for sure that these are durable, and they don't fall off easily. So I just want to exaggerate that because um, you'd think that the gems would fall off easily, but they do put a lot of work into these to make sure that they stay on. So um, like I said, I will put the links down below for you guys. Um, they have a Facebook page, a YouTube page, and um, a Twitter. So I don't really use Twitter, but I will put all their links down below so you can check them out. And um, if you have any questions at all, if I left something out, um, feel free to ask me and I will answer it for you. So thank you guys for watching. You guys have a great night.